Hello and welcome back. This is Double O Debbie, and this is episode 124 of my Ocean Block Let's Play. <laughs> Hard work, and getting all that out. Um, in today's episode, uh, we are going to try to automate our very first ultimate singularity ever. <laughs> so I've got a little bit of groundwork set up over here at energy place because there's uh, plenty of room out here so I went ahead and took all of our draconic uh, fusion crafting injectors out of the um, compact machine and then I made 12 more uh, so that I could keep these separate uh, because there are 30 items that have to go in and you can't really use a crafter for that so I'm going to put some exporters and just export each individual singularity into its own crafting injector. Uh, and then that way it'll be ready uh, and I can send the, um, what is it called, entangled, quantum entangled singularity I think is what it's called, uh, which we're going to make right now. Oh, I think you can make them more than one at a time, I hope. Um, so, do this. Oh, um, I'm so scared. Okay, um, I might, I don't know how I can turn my magnet off. I think I might be able to a way hotkey for it. Options, controls, and mechanism. Beat mode switch. I wonder if it because the magnet is actually on the boots. Let's try it. B. B. Oh, magnetic attraction unit disabled. Awesome. Okay. So let's toss these down back up. One made two. Okay. That's kind of funny, but okay, I got some of the basics laid out already. I've got the cable. keep wanting to say applied energistics, but this is not applied energistics, it's her from the storage. I got the cable laid out and all of these are hooked up. So all I have to do is uh, tell it to put one of each, or it's just going to be able to put one in each one um, because it's on single item mode. It'll only accept one. Um, then that should kick everything in all at once <laughs> once I get these set up and it should start making again because I have it set up to always keep four singularities except for I still don't have um, how we doing on super premium uh, see we've <laughs> we're kind of getting some built up but uh, still not enough for two more. We still need two more just so I can get the four that we need to make one let's see um, I think 
think it's the creative essence. Yeah, that stuff. Yeah, it takes four ultimate singularities. And it takes a lot of insanium. So we're going to need uh, to get our Supremium uh, Coal Singularities and then we're going to have to start producing an insane amount of Insanium <laughs> uh, so that we can get the Creative Essence because the Creative Essence is used in uh, making this guy the Creative Storage upgrade? Oh no! Look at this! It's a chaotic tier, but it takes 20 items. We only have 12, so we're gonna need another 8 chaotic ejectors. That's gonna make auto crafting for this. A little bit. Oh goodness, it takes antimatter pellets. We're gonna have to get that set up too. Um, I do have a butt ton of polonium. Polonium. <laughs> polonium, not polonium. I have 887. Uh, I ran out of my fluorite dust, so it stopped making it. So I need to make the casing so we can get the phase shifting thingy, uh, what is it called, um, this super critical phase shifter, uh, that multi-block structure, we need to get that guy going. Um, I just think I want it to be out here by the polonium. That way I don't have to transport it very far. Like maybe extend the platform over this way. Um, I already lowered this pipe down so I can stick a pipe on the front. Although <laughs> it's, uh, I might need Oh, you know what I could do? Is I could entangle this block and put it uh, out over here like I want and then just pipe it out without having to remove my power. Because uh, everything's set up perfectly. <laughs> You've got all the bases on this block being used. So that being said, uh, we're getting, we're making progress. Um, hey, oh, okay, let's go clear away the rain and the phantoms. The phantoms really aren't a bother anymore since I have that trinket that makes enemies attacking me burn. So they never actually touch me anymore. They just take damage from burning and then fly away. <laughs> so that's pretty cool. Um, okay, so I am going to set each one up uh, to uh, use one singularity uh, to load them up into the injectors and then I guess I'll be right back. Okay, I got all that set up. 
Oh, also, I used this wireless power. I finally figured out I was using the wrong crystal. I was using the relay and not the wireless energy crystal. So once I figured that out, it works like a charm. Uh, so I figured that would be a little less clutter around uh, the 30 injectors to just hook it up wirelessly. Uh, and I think it's going to look cool with all the sparks flying everywhere. Um, how's our little guy coming? Uh, it's getting there. Um, I had to limit this guy for a little while because it was just pumping everything right back out. Uh, so now it's only allowed to put out like 800,000 FP a tick. I guess if I need more, I'll turn it up later, but for now. I think that should be fine. I think so. Um, okay, so we got that hooked up. Now all we have to do is get get it to uh, send a, a quantum entangled singularity into this chest, uh, which should then trigger the crafting for this. Oh, I forgot I'm going to have to uh, get an importer on here. Oh, I got an importer right there. Um, so I guess I can just put you here. I still got my cables. I'm just do that guy. And oh, oh. All right. okay. <laughs> so that's taken care of. Uh, now I gotta do is uh, this stuff, I don't think this needs to be as complicated as before. Um I just want to know when the signal is 15, when it's strong enough to, uh, when it's done crafting, to signal and reset this uh, crafter to insert the next pulse or the next set. Oh, but we we gotta do this guy. Um, we gotta have him work off of redstone too. Only work with the redstone signal. Yeah. Uh, so when the crafting is done, we'll have it uh, pull out. Oh, I forgot I turned my magnet off. There we go. That's nice. <laughs> I like that. B for boots. Um, but I think the other signals are like two and three. So it'll only ever be higher than two or three when it's at 15. So if I do this and add one more, should only ever get to here when the crafting is complete. Um, then I want to just bring this recipe level one no we want level two um let me put 
this away. And this away. to just go right um, you so let's try it out <laughs> I'm so excited ultimate craft start oh it's why is it saying that um, of using one of those from there. Let's go back. Um, instead of this guy. We'll take one of these and put it in there. And see if that helps. Maybe it's just an issue. have to detect when it's level one and we have to send a signal to start craft. Forgot about that. Okay. Uh, how to get this over there? This might not be what I'm thinking I need. I might need the XNet. Okay, let me figure this out and I will be right back. Aha! It's working! <laughs> Check it out! Okay, I had to hook up some XNet. But look! You did it! <laughs> you did it! We got our first singularity! Check it out. Okay, so... Um, had to use these. Uh, I'm hoping these works. Uh, I'm hoping they work. But the signal of redstone one is hooked up and is working. I think I can put these blocks back now. Um, so now we need to take the finished crafting signal and tell it 
Uh, how come you're not seeing the other one? There's two redstone proxies. Um, I think it might not be seeing this one. We just need to check. I will do that off, I thought. redstone guys on red aha okay so it took it out and then it should have reset or another I cracked her and prepared it for the next set Ooh, um now let's see we should have two of everything. Um, I think the capacitato, which I forgot about, uh, because every time you log off and you log back in, you have to reset the recipe for it to work. So, yeah, it's it's currently working. We have two. We used one, and uh, we've got another in here somewhere. <laughs> so we have made two quite quickly so uh, but everything should be turned on now except for the supremium. We need to probably turn that back on. Uh, yeah we used our last singularity putting it in there. How is our Ethereum doing? We got 60,000 and 11,000 seeds. Oh, holy cow, bunga. Okay, I, I want to, I want to clear out some of those seeds. Oh, wrong way. So let's, um, doing this but the one machine just isn't fast enough uh, for three power pops <laughs> when it can you know spit out uh, a stack at a time it's just not going to keep up I might need to get a couple more of those I just want to <laughs> Fill up this thing. Oh my goodness. Oh, okay, that should that should be good. Five thousand is way better than eleven. <laughs> okay, so we can cr I want to see if it's ready to craft again, but the same time I don't want to like waste it uh, but I know I'll need another one 
Uh, so let's give it a go. What do you say? Um, let's test it out again. Oh, Rain, you have to pick up right now. <laughs> I'm so happy. All right, let's go. It sent one in. Got the power of one. Why didn't it? Why didn't it hit Rob? Okay, it went ahead and sent it in, so I know this was reset. So why didn't you take the redstone signal and send it? Redstone equal to one. And redstone is equal to one. Then send it on white. Yeah, I had to run cable all the way over there because I forgot that you can't send a redstone signal through here. So it has to go directly to our Fusion Crafting Core. And why isn't it, why isn't it going? started okay I don't know why <laughs> it should have worked there it goes look at it I love the little rain of energy down that is super cool oh, okay so now it's not detecting that there's an item in there it is but it's not working um, Okay, so let's do that and create a second one, uh, a duplicate, just like this one. I'm going to do redstone of 15 on blue to go to new. Blue. 
Okay. I don't know why that's not working automatically, but uh, it's, it's seeing the signal and stuff. Okay. But we made two. I don't think we have enough. We got empty spots, so it won't be a valid recipe. And the only one we're missing is, should be the Supremium Coal, <laughs> actually. The Supremium Coal. Yes. Oh, 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 sweet. Um, even though it's not working fully, uh, but it should. Logically, it should work. Um, I don't know why it's not. Um, it's all like connected and everything. So we did it. We got our ultimate singularity. Not only that, we got two ultimate singularities oh, oh, oh. <laughs> we're halfway there <laughs> for part of it anyway um so we need a lot more ethereum than we're currently producing so i need to go um i need to go turn turn that on uh, which one of you is the Supremium Coal? There you are. I see you. It's like the only red one. Um, we want to emit a signal when under the amount. So now it should start loading everything up. Oh, look at that. It had almost enough for another one. Already waiting. Sweet. Oh, so then we should be able to make a third one if we wanted to. Uh, that's going to make that. Um, and then it should start using up some of the Ethereum 31,000 that we have, uh, creating more Supremium. Um, I, have, I have the little guy. I don't know if I showed you this, but I changed one of the crafters uh, to craft each one on demand. Um, I don't know why it's not sending it in here. Uh, it's probably making a lot of stuff right now. Let's look. Oh yeah, it's processing 32,000 Ethereum essence. Um, and refined obsidian, cast iron ingots, vacuum tubes, uh, enriched iron, uh, supremium coal. Yeah, let's cancel those because I think they're just bugged. Okay, and, and now it's trying to do it again. Oh, it's not getting an error, so that's good. So it's making it like a stack at a time. That's cool. That is cool. So it's making lots of stuff. I love it. Um, it should be replenishing everything. <laughs> it's very, very busy. Um, let's look at our singularities. Uh, so. Okay, we had extra clay. We had a couple of them we had extra above and beyond. The four, so some of them might, uh, might actually be four still or above. Look, our Tesseract one. I think I actually turned the Tesseract one off because it was trying to, I don't know, it was, it was messing up. It was sending so much all at once um, to the system. I think it was just overloading it. Let's come down here and look. Uh, yeah, like the whole chest would be full. This whole chest back here would be full of things. Oh, look. 
We got plenty of Enderium in there, or Molten Ender. Um, I think the reason I shut it off is because I was low on Ender Pearls. Um, yeah, we, we kind of got backed up here. Um, so we need to turn, we need to find the Tesseract one and turn it back on and monitor it uh, because I think it's going to be a troublesome area. Um, what do you, no, I don't need Vital Grow. I think. Look at all the lights are on. Oh my goodness. So where did I just take the recipe out or something? That would be one way to shut it off. Not allow it to craft anymore. No, the recipe's still in here. No redstone signal. <laughs> Start throwing them in there and letting them clear up. Because I have a lot of resources tied up in those. Um, I guess what I could do is if I could get back there. right here I could put another one and speed it up uh, by twice by skip set <laughs> or double by speed by adding another one of these I might do that uh, oh yeah because it's not growing very fast at all and I think I actually have an extra yeah I made a blue magma one and I didn't need a high temperature I needed a low temperature uh, so, yeah, um, I don't, I don't have any, oh, I did have a little cast iron tube on there, that's sweet, um, real quick, boom, 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 and what do you use? 
So I should theoretically just have to place this next to it. It should connect up and then all I should have to do is uh, tell it what to craft. drops below 5,000, whether that thing's on or not, it should start producing. Oh, it's got 58,000? That is really nice. <laughs> I like it. Okay, so we increased our Tesseract production. Um, Turned on the capacitato. How are you doing? Okay, it's doing a little bit better. Um, let's get another stack of frames. Another stack. Um, actually, let's get like get like that many and just throw a whole bunch in there and forget about it for a while. <laughs> and that should be that should uh that should keep it busy for a little bit. Uh, but we made a lot of progress today. I am so happy that we got uh, the singularity, the ultimate singularity. Uh, <laughs> this is great. Um, this is my first time to get an ultimate singularity and it's I mean I don't know the progression of all of the different mod packs from before um, I haven't played modded Minecraft that much or I have but I haven't gone that deep uh, so I'm really excited to be this progressed and I'm still having fun um, <laughs> I love this mod pack it's so great um, we're going to turn this off. We still need to set up, uh, got so much more to do, even though we've come so far, there's so much more to do, to learn, and to have fun, and I'm so excited to be playing this mod pack. Um, <laughs> anyway, I hope you're still excited too. Um, let me know in the comments, I would love to hear from you. But Thank you for watching, and we'll see you next time. Bye-bye!